Welcome to the last three holes at the K Club. We've got a challenge for you. For us. The challenge, challenge is for us. <laughs> We're going to play 16th, 17th and 18th. Three extremely iconic holes here at the K Club. The match that we've got is you use it, you lose it. Yep. So if you use a club, you lose it. So we'll see whatever we shoot for the last three holes. Has anyone ever not finished a hole and lost all the golf clubs? Yeah, <laughs> I think it's about but, to but, happen. But that might uh, that that normally happens after about four, five, six holes, not three holes. Not one hole. No. <laughs> par four, par three, par five finish. And one footnote: you make a birdie, unlikely to happen. You get a golf club back. So we got 435 yards on this par four, 16th hole. Water down the right hand side. Water all the way up the uh, in the front of the green as well. So it's just about trying to hit the fairway and keep hold of the fairway. Club. I'm using hybrid because I really, really want my driver and three wood. Well, you want to you want to keep hold of your driver and three wood for probably uh, 18. eighteen. Yeah, I am I am hugging the left side. I don't even care if I go behind the tree. Okay. Oh, Lee, that's perfect. Really floaty, but but perfect. I think. Yeah. Hanging on for dear life, but that is your hybrid gone. I'm in play. <laughs> yeah, great shot. I've probably got another one of those into the green and I haven't got one, but I am in play. I think with a good drive up 18, if Rory can do it and it five went in, I can do it. Yeah, because you're, you're 345, 350 off the tee, aren't you? Is this wind out the right? Yeah. Someone once told me you just got to hit a good shot. you just got to commit to this shot. <laughs> it's in his head. Go back to an old swing, a swing of mine, and see if it works. Back in the, you know, like the old junior swing, you know. Junior, junior Dan. It's oh, great shot. Oh, what God. a shot! Oh, it's miles down there. Dan, advantage, Daniel. Junior Dan is back. <laughs> I always said that the Callaway golf ball was the number one lost ball in golf, and there's proof again. It's not mine. You are so far, far back <laughs> here. So far back. Strategic, because you ain't got your three wood now, and I've still got that for 18. 237 yards, the middle of that green. Correct. So I'm just going to lay up. I'm about to lose my eight iron. Don't go in the water. Bouncing. Layup. It's a good, good layup. layup. Good layup, Luke. Dan has found the centre of the, probably the hardest fairway I've ever tried to find in my life. Like, if you just look back at it from here, this is about 240 just to carry this part, so you could have gone for it for driver, but then you go too far right, there's water there. <laughs> like, that is 177 metres. It's going to be helping. I've got 192 to the flag. Yep. I've got 166 to carry the water. I'm going to try and hit a five iron. I need to strike it because if I don't strike it, I'm water bound. He struck one, but he has bailed right. Yeah, just started a bit right. Oh, oh no. no! Oh no! Oh my god! <laughs> I got that perfectly. <laughs> Let's lose, a, let's lose a wedge, shall we? Oh my god. Oh. Oh my god. What's the carry over that bit then? Oh yes, 190 over that bit of water. Yeah, that wasn't the line, Dan. Oh dear. 110 you've got. Suddenly my layup looks a lot like a better option, doesn't it? Absolutely. <laughs> I mean, it's such a, like, to be going in there with five iron, it's not designed for longer clubs in there, I suppose, but, because you've got water back right as well. I didn't even spot that. Yeah. Kind of a bit, it's actually a bit like an island green. It's, um, it's just the hardest hole I've ever seen in my life. Right, 50 degree. There is no water. <laughs> is that a right club or have you caught that a bit too thin? Oh, you don't remember, you don't lose your putter, so you are, but you're going to be chipping that, so. I have lost my 50. Yeah, and another wedge in a minute. 77 yards. 77 yards. What are you losing? You're 58? I feel like you've got to be aggressive. I'm going to use, lose my 54 because if I end up in the bunker somewhere, I'm going to want my 58. Yeah. It's 
just safe, isn't it? Like, it's, it's definitely safe. I feel pat. Chance of a bogey, is it? So Drop you've lost two. three Drop clubs and I've lost three clubs. Drop for th played in for two. Drop for three. Played four. Got that from a bogey. Soon add up, don't they? Wow. Look at this. It is properly like an island green. And I was at 192 to that flag. But you've got to make sure you land it with a five iron. I had to land it 185, which is right on my number. And where I've kind of gone is just in this portion here. So at 190, it, it just isn't going to get across there. So my landing zone is tiny with a five iron. Absolutely tiny. I'm going to lose my pitching wedge. Are you? Yeah. I want my 54 and 60 in case I need to chip around that green or chip around the next one. Oh yeah, I forgot we've got another hole in between it. This is number one, two, Four. three. This is your fourth club, gone. Yeah. Steady. Okay, I'll take okay. that. I shall take that, Daniel. I feel like you've got a bit of an advantage by going in the water. Because you um, you're here for four, I'm here for four. Although I should have been on the green for three, to be fair. Yeah, it's my own fault. I suppose, if you think about it, you probably should lose one as a drop. What, like player's choice? Yeah. I, I think that's a great idea. Yeah, yeah, I think that's only fair, isn't it? Yeah, I think you're... It's just a penalty, it's nothing, is it? Nah, apart from the shot on the medal. Okay, you've lost your six iron then. Six irons gone, so that's the club for the next. I, I don't want to be mean and take your driver off you for 18. I feel like you need that moment in your life. Oh, sorry, okay. no, I, I need that moment in my life. <laughs> I'm almost almost writing off the birdie thing, you know, where you get, your, where you get a club back. Oh, yeah, that's gone, like, that's not happening. Oof. That's not stone dead. You uh, tied it up? Yeah, you tied it up for a little, little double. Good double. It was easily done, wasn't it? Well, yeah. Easy double, lost four clubs. We could do with this to get off, getting a little one shot lead and then we're all square on clubs. Pushed it. Yeah. Pushed it. Big push. Okay, good start from us two. Yeah, solid. Four doubles. clubs gone and each and both Double. two over. Yeah, lovely. 17th hole then. I mean, as par threes go, it doesn't get much more challenging than this. 171 yards off this back tee, water all the way down the right hand side. You can't bail out left because you've got bunkers there. You've just, again, you've got to hit another good shot. I think my six iron's gone, so for me it's going to be seven iron. And for you, six iron. Straight down wind, maybe a smidgen at your left. Okay. Played one. You get it? Got it. Got it. That's a class shot. Thank you. Where have you come from? It was a strategic six I took. Yeah, you did. It's a smart play, that. And I got a chance to get a club back. Oh, yeah, with a bird. Yeah, that's a good point, mate. That's a good point. So you got a seven? Yeah. I'm going to have to rip it. Dan's about to put his back out. Oh, he's played one. Get left, get left, get left. Left. Okay, I didn't sit down. Didn't sit down. Behind that bush from where I am. Yeah, it's alright, it's safe, but it's chipping. Ooh, there's another gone. Dan flirting with water, but that is not on the green. That is another club required. Where did that land, you think? That's landed literally on the edge here, isn't it? Yeah, right there. And then jumped backwards. So, what, what wedge have you got? Well, I've got, my no I've got a 50 on my 9 iron I've brought out, and I'm thinking that I don't really, I, ideally, I don't really want to lose my, nut, my 50. You've still got your 58, haven't you? I've still got my 58, but it gives me a couple of extra options around the green there. So if I can just get a 9 iron running. Whip. I'm looking for a birdie, is what I'm looking for. You, you don't go, don't you go into that water, Dad? Chip this in, Lee. There's no point in birdie in the last, is there? No. That's such a class shot by you. Brilliant shot. Thank you. Heel off the ground, get a bit more toe into the ground, push it forward, release it to the hole, and, and go in. Oh, 
that. <laughs> How's that not gone in? <laughs> that has to that has to turn from there. <laughs> it was a great chip, mind you. <laughs> it's always moving in from there. Good par. That's just a par. As par threes go, this is as good as it gets. This defence with the bunker on the left really makes you kind of have to hit a good shot. Water all the way down the right. It's just fantastic. Imagine being, imagine being coming down the stretch when you like got a lead coming in at a tournament or something like that. Just playing these last three two holes that we've just played and then eighteen as well. Card wreckers. They are card wreckers. However, this could be a two when I get the club back. Yeah, which club are you going to take back? I don't know yet. Let's get the two. First. Hybrid, I would think. Let's get the two first. Short. Short, short, oh. short. Th this for your, this to stay with me. Plus two. Good two putt. Yeah, solid par. Lost your six iron though. Yes. The 18th hole. If you remember, you had Rory McIlroy coming down 18 and there's a plaque up here where he hit five wood, which I might have a little look at that as we get up there. But the hooker's graveyard and it's a massive dogleg round from left to right off the tee and then it sort of meanders its way back round to the right to left as it come up, comes up towards the hole. Water all the way down the left hand side with your second shot in, over water to the green. There's only one club for this tee shot, we've been saving it, it's the driver. Oh, it could be the most anti-climatic saving of a club in the world. Yeah, so you've got, you've got, you've lost five clubs haven't you? Yeah, I've lost, I've lost six. hybrid, six, eight, fifty pitcher match. Okay, and now driver. And now the the big driver. I've never wanted a decent drive so much in all my life. Oh my word, you nailed it. Like, tour players would pay a lot of money for that one up this hole. Oh. When you need to, you do get it get it going, <laughs> don't you? Just hope I'm on fairway so I can have a crack at it. Even if I'm like 290 yards away, I, like the left foot's coming up and everything. I'm going for it. You are going for it. Oh, he's taking a massive tiger line there. Oh, oh, I think it's dropped down behind that tree. So, do you think that dropped down? Do you see it? I, saw, I think I saw it, but I was looking in the rangefinder. It definitely hit it's wood. That, and then it's got to the top of its flight, and then the wind's just started to drift it right. So, we've found Dan's ball. It is sat down. What options have you got? You've got five wood still, three I've got iron. Five wood, which I now, if I hit this, I won't be able to hit my five wood. But do you need to hit it again? Three iron, eh? Do you need to hit your, you're not going to need to hit your three wood, five wood again now. Oh yeah, you're, gonna, you're not going to, you're never going to be 220 away from that flag, are you? Yeah, but I can't, I don't think I can get a five wood on that. No, so you've got, you've no, got, got five wood. I've got eight iron. Seven iron. Okay. Oh no, you've hit your seven. No, seven iron's gone, I've got eight iron, wedge, yeah, or three iron. <laughs> <laughs> I got it for five but then, haven't I? Because I can't get like the three iron isn't coming out of there. No. Rip down on it. I don't want to go left, because anything left of that flag there is in the water. Oh that's a great shot. That's gonna run. Oh he's after it. He's after it. Oh my god. Is it the water? He's literally that far away from it bounced left and rolled. Oh. Little, little minor moment. Little minor moment. <laughs> Big bomber Lee. Let's find it out there, I outdrove Rory. Yeah, we're going over there now. But we didn't because we have a forward tee. Oh yeah. So he's come over the big bunker that we saw and then there was two other bunkers here ready for him. 216? Yeah. Is that right? Yeah. Oh, you can get four iron on that, can't you? 216? I mean, you know it's a perfect hybrid, don't you? I'd love my hybrid right now. <laughs> I'd absolutely love it. And if you think about it, I'm not sure if you get four iron your three wood was the right selection on the on the sixteenth, really, wasn't it? Yeah. I'm not sure I can get three four iron up quick enough. You're gonna lay it with a nine. Yeah, I feel I feel more confident hitting an easier seven. Yeah, I'm gonna lay it with a nine. That's another bunker. <laughs> He's really, really, really in the bunker. Rory McIlroy, in the Dubai Duty Free Irish Open, hit a five wood, 256 yards to the pin, 
22nd of May 2016 to make Eagle and win the event. It was a back right pin when he played it. Today, we've kind of got more in the center of the green. I know they're protecting the, the greens as much as they can for the big championship that we've got coming up here, but we've got to hit five woods. And my ShotScope Pro L2 is telling me 220 to the carry the water, 245 to the flag. And I don't own a five wood. Well, you'd be a, you've got a hybrid, which is your five wood, isn't it? What degree aloft is a five wood? 19. Oh, well then, yeah. 220, have you got 220 in that club? Just. You have ripped that. You tried to cut it off the water. Thank you. How do you do this? <laughs> what? Like Rory's got nothing on you, has he? <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely nothing Thank you. on you. Thank you, ladies and gents. <laughs> I knew it wasn't jawing, so it was just a a big wallop with a hybrid. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> That's impressive. Okay. Right side, that's middle of the fairway, I middle of the green. I didn't see a splash. You have not, you don't see that? No. So it's landed in the right corner, just short right of the green. It's hit the rocks, it's pinged across the green, and it's landed like just left of your ball in the water. <laughs> oh well, I win that one. Well done you and well done Rory. That is a very plugged golf ball. And that is a double <laughs> teapotter right there. <laughs> what weapon of choice do you have now? Well, I've got to do a 54 so I can, if I get it out, I've then got a 58 in. You don't fancy 58 to make sure it comes out and then 54 on? No. No. Yes, Lee, it's out. Is it far enough down there for a uh, 58 yeah, though? It's fine. Yeah. <laughs> 96 yards to the middle of that green, Lee. What is it? How far you got? 89 to the flag. 60 degree wedge. You're hemorrhaging clubs at the moment. What? Got what? to get on the green. What? How many clubs you got left? Oh, you got four iron. I got four iron, seven iron. That's it. And that's it. Yeah. yeah, that's there, but it's a long way away, I think. I'm potting. I don't care. I'm. I'm safe with clubs. <laughs> right. So advantage done now. I need you Chance to two bird. putt and I need to one putt. Not happening. What a trip. Yeah, loved it. We've managed loved to squeeze it. in the last three holes. We've got 25 minutes before we have to jump on a flight. But what a trip. Are you impressed with uh, this golf course? Yeah, I'm just, I'm a bit gutted we never managed to do all 18. No, there's, some, done, there's some lovely holes there, We've yeah. done 12, but, yeah. like, if we come back here again, I'm, like, I, we've just got to play this course, and here it's... It's so good. It's the best course I've played all day. Yeah, is it? Yeah. Is it, really? Just, I said it at the beginning, but you just, now you're like, mm, I've played some good ones in Dubai, and... Yeah, I think, you know, it's just... It's just a different level of golf course that I've played. There's don't wrong, like the Jumeirah in Dubai, if you ever experience it, it's the hardest golf course I've ever played, but this is the best I've played. Wandering up the green of this iconic hole, Lee just picking up his five wood. I had a second go with my five wood, got it on the front edge for an Instagram post, but down the hill, out of his left. Not moved. Great for pace, just not moved on you. <sighs> Good effort. Thanks. Two pots to win, Dan. What club would I get back in the bag if I, uh, if I hold this to go home with? Because <laughs> you've got to stay here, haven't you? I've got no here. clubs to go home with. <laughs> we've got four iron and the we're seven under, iron. We're going to be underweight for the first time <laughs> ever on a flight. Ooh! Racy, 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 racy. You smashed it. You smashed it. You win, Daniel. I win, thank you very much. Well, that was just a bit of fun. Last three holes here at the wonderful K Club. Absolutely fantastic facility. Just a big thank you to the K Club for putting us up over the last sort of couple of days. We've had a fantastic trip. Lee, thanks for the game. Pleasure. And I'll see everybody again very soon.